Hello everyone, today I wanted to recreate the strawberry girl makeup look with the products from my own collection. I know I'm pretty late on this trend, but I did film this a while ago and just didn't get to editing and uploading this video until recently, so I hope you guys would still enjoy. To start off, I'm using the Kosas Dream Beam sunscreen for a glowy base. I just have the mini sample size of it and have been enjoying it, but I don't think I'm going to purchase the full size because I do always wear a separate sunscreen underneath my makeup and there are other glowy primers for a cheaper price out there. But overall, it is a nice product to give you a glowy look without any visible particles of glitters or shimmers. For my coverage product, I'm using the Merit's Complexion Stick as a concealer. Although the price of this product is still pretty up there, it's a product I constantly use in my collection for daily coverage. It has good amount of coverage and the formula is so creamy and easy to work with. And since the strawberry look is all about the natural vibes, I'm just using it under my eyes and on a couple of spots around my face for the effortless and natural look. Next, I'm going to use the Refi's Tinted Brow Gel for my brows. I love Refi as a brand in general and this brow gel didn't disappoint me either. It has a really cool ball tip applicator that works really well to comb through each brow hair and give the most natural tint to them. The formula is also super light and gel-like and gives a pretty good hold. I wanted to achieve a natural, fluffy, yet still full brows for this look, which made this product a perfect fit. Now for the star of the show, the Pixie on the Glow blush in the shade Ruby. You really can't ask for a better shade than this for the ultimate strawberry girl look. It has a perfect mix of red and pink that makes it super poppy and bright yet still very wearable. The cream formula is also very buildable and it gives the most youthful and dewy cheeks. I'm also putting the same blush all around the perimeter of my face as well, almost like a bronzer to tie in the look all together as well. Next for highlighter, I'm going to use this Tower 28 Super Dew Highlight Balm. It's just a balm without any glitter or shimmer, just a glow from the creamy formula. I thought this product would make this look extra dewy and glowy and just very natural as well. The balm isn't too oily or greasy and it's actually lightweight enough to put on the face. So I use it whenever I want the most natural, almost a skincare kind of a glow. And I'm going to powder some places and set it by using the e.l.f. Halo Glow Setting Powder, but this is completely optional. Next, I'm going to use two separate brown mascaras to achieve a very natural yet long and clean lashes. I'll be using the Kiss Me Long and Curl Brown Mascara for my upper lashes and then the Glossier Lash Flick in the shade Brown for my bottom lashes. Next, I'm going to use the Glossier Brow Flick as a very, very natural eyeliner. I use this in my everyday makeup as well. It just really naturally elongates and emphasize your eyes. Next, we're going to use a NYX Lip Pencil for my lips. First, I'm going to line my lips with a lip pencil, which is a very close shade to my natural lip line to just naturally make a fuller, more clean looking lips. Then I'm going to dab on some of the blush that I put on my cheeks to make that monochromatic look. And this product feels really comfortable on the lips and the color looks amazing. Next, the Strawberry Girl makeup look would not be complete without some fall freckles. I'm going to use the Freck Beauty freckles to make some natural freckles just around my nose and the butterfly zone area. And then finally finishing off the look with the Road Peptide Lip Treatment on top of the blush shade that I just put on my lips. I have this salted caramel scent which makes it such a pleasure to put it on every time and it's super hydrating and glossy which is also perfect for this look. And that everyone was my take on the strawberry girl makeup look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did. It was super fun to make and I am excited to continue making and recreating these very cute makeup looks in the future as well. So hope to see you on my next video. Bye!